Hi guys, I'm going to be doing another neon water marble today, uh, again with the China Glaze Poolside Collection. And this time I decided to put kind of the warmer tones toward my cuticle and the cooler tones toward the tip of my nail, kind of the opposite of what I did last time. Uh, as before, since I am using so many colors with this water marble, you can see all of the individual names in the information bar. But this is China Glaze's summer collection, the poolside collection, and all the colors are neon. So I'm just going to go ahead and build my bullseye. I've got a cup of room temperature filtered water. And then once I get one more dot in here, I'm just going to take my orange stick and use a very light touch um, to avoid making too many bald spots. Um, because the neon polish does dry quicker than some polishes, it doesn't necessarily flow back um, when you pull your orange stick through it. So you just want to use the very tip, the pointiest part of your orange stick, and just use a really light touch uh, to make sure that you don't get too many bald spots. I have my nail prepped with a coat of Color Club French Tip, just my basic white. Uh, as well as some scotch tape. And I'm going to aim uh, the blue section of this design toward the tip of my nail and basically just try to get some of every color onto my nail. Like that. I'm going to clean up this bit on top with my orange stick. And once that's all clean, go ahead and pull my finger out and there you can see the rainbow water marble design. Um, if you'd like to see some more pictures of this manicure, you can check out my blog, mysimplelittlepleasures.blogspot.com and like I said last time, I used a white base because I wanted the neon colors to really pop, but you could use black for something a little darker or experiment with other colors and get a different look with every different base color. So, hope you guys give this one a try, and thanks for watching.